Hi everyone. We are going to learn basic crochet. Uh, how to hold the hook and uh, anything about uh, how to start a project. So this one, this this yarn is acrylic. And, uh, you always you can always read here, and you will see also what what crochet hook you need for this. Here is it. Um, in this yarn, you can use 1.9. Uh, US crochet or 5.5 millimeter so this one I'm using I always like love to use uh, crochet 3.75 is my favorite and 4 4 74 millimeter or 375 millimeter or 450 yeah I always love to use this because it make it really nice I make the project really nice this is my favorite but it was it is written here that you can use 5.5 hook that's the first thing you need to read and uh, this one is a uh, acrylic yarn but it's for summer you know that there is summer crochet and the, the other one is thick for uh, winter so all these details you need them before you begin your project okay let's begin how to make a simple crochet for beginners okay this is the hook uh, 3.75 this is the acrylic yarn let's begin before you hold it like this some people they know but there are some rules that we are going to teach also so follow us so you know the basic rules for crochet even if you know there are basic rules that you need to know also you can begin by tidying the rope like this for people who want to begin my daughter also has done it with us she start to know what, I, what I'm teaching you now. I taught her. If you have a little girl that love crochet, uh, she can learn with us. Okay? Teach her how to do this. Sometimes it's hard to teach them, you know, but you see here. Uh, do this. Take the crochet here, the thing, the yarn. Let it be like this. And then do this. So you can do this. So for them, they have to know what to do first. If you are somebody who also learning, you can also do this. My camera is not good, but we are going to manage. Okay. okay because this one we need to be near you see this one is a shin one two three four five six seven eight nine ten let's make 15 so we can make this as a project one two two and also you see here you pull from here don't use this one so the crochet will not mess up for you this one leave it just pull it from inside here yeah all this techniques you need to learn two three four five 
so this we can use it as a dish cloth we can clean our dishes with the, this project we're doing we make it something okay and then six seven eight nine ten okay so now this is the the shin we made this it's like uh, ten we 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 shin this ten times you see so there are different of the the next line we're gonna do a uh, single crochet we're gonna do single crochet for the next time line and then i will teach you after we learn single crochet we're gonna do double crochet okay double crochet we will i will teach you and then another one is half double crochet okay half double crochet single crochet and then the double so this one is single crochet whenever you hear single crochet it's this one now you use it always for uh, to do the the dish cloth or you do things that you want the crochet to be neat yeah to be yeah, like there is you don't want any holes in your crochet if you're making a project like a dish cloth or you want to make like face wash people always use single crochet so single crochet is this when you begin take one like this okay you see the one that you took here this one leave it leave this line put it in the next one in this time you just hook here don't do any thing just insert the crochet insert it in the next one like this insert it and pull like this insert it again pull like this insert pull insert you see insert and then learn how to hold this also you can do this like this and teach your child how to it takes long to make them learn how to hold the the hook you know my daughter was just like six months for her she just learn this but she learned how to do this now to hold the yarn and uh, to do this line like this but not the second line is still i don't know if she can do it now but she will learn from this video so we have to teach our kids some skills you never know maybe in the future I started learning this from my stepmom actually in WOW a long time ago when I was six years old and my sister was also doing it and so I learned I, uh, they would buy me a small yarn and then and the crochet and I started learning in my early age so now I'm just know it and it's my thing you know i love crochet it's good for your mental health <laughs> when you do crochet you will not think too much you will focus on it and you will you just be excited when you do a nice project and you will think for the next project so now we left with two two uh, single crochet to do you see here is another technique I want you to know if you are already know how to do crochet you need to know these techniques that I'm teaching you now okay this is the one before the last one this one and then this is the last one here you see the last one here you put it and take it out okay see we are going to turn the turning sometimes is difficult for people who want to if you want to make it like a big tablecloth you may make like 
oh, 30 of this line and then you go through them and do the same thing I'm teaching you now 30 or 40 if you want the, the project to be very large so now before you turn take one like this one single crochet here and turn you see when you turn this one the first one here after you took one learn this so your crochet can be straight from here that's why you're doing one before you you turn and just start now pull one and then turn and then this the very big first one here will you just do this again don't don't do this don't do this no do this the first one here and you will see how it turns you see another single crochet the next one another single crochet the next one like this you see here we are doing this because here you want the line to be straight right that's that's the technique that i want you to learn and then we will teach you how to what to do with this uh, rope later this yarn i'll teach you how, what to do with it so and i will teach you also what tools you need other than crochet to help you achieve your uh, project you see again you do this the next one here you go this one the next one you can teach your child you just take the idea and let her uh, do it on her own she can mess it up but you have to open it again and try try several times but if you uh, happen to know the crochet, how to hold it, and you have the ideas, so these techniques I'm teaching you now will help you. Yeah, we are doing this all 20 pieces, 20 single crochet, 20 single crochet. Yeah, we are doing this. You're taking out from here, so your crochet will be, your yarn will be clean and. Uh, not yeah you don't, will not have problems you just get out until it's done you know you see here the next one so the last one will be like this the last one will be like this here you see so this one here this one here here is the last one the last crochet okay this one will be the last one This one will be the last one. Okay. And then you will turn again. You will turn again and do the same. Let me turn for you. Like this. You will take one. Always take one and turn the this. And then you're going to put it here. You're going to insert the crochet in the beginning here. If you insert the crochet in the, the next one, the project will be not straight. You will notice that the, your project is messing up. Okay, so this is the technique for today. You have to learn it. And then I will show you the picture of the... And then you can go like uh, 7 line or 10 line. But I'm going to do 10 line and show you the last uh, work for our project for today. So see, see here, see the line here, it's going straight like this. So use this technique. Thank you very much. Bye.